back. Maji's back. Maji is back. All right, I see a lot of you guys have been chit chatting here, huh? <laughs> Who, who's this artist? Are you on this live right now? Where is this huge celebrity? Where are you? This is what the world is asking. Where are you? Where are you? I hear people, okay? They're asking about you already or they're about to. All right. Welcome in, guys. Go get your tea. Go get your water. Um, okay, you know I'm always hydrated out here. Welcome, guys. So, interesting enough, I was shuffling the cards and I knew... The Holy Spirit was guiding me here throughout this entire message. I just knew because of all the signs and synchronicities that I have received today has been incredible, guys. OK, um, if you haven't checked out my community post, please do so now or later. Um, the thumbnail of this live is Beyonce. OK, and Destiny's Child. And that is the exact same picture that I have received um, from Spirit. As I was outside, okay, I was hanging out, I was outside, and I'm just seeing all these signs of somebody's about to blow up, somebody's about to get the six of wands, um, ace opportunity here, okay, boss energy, excuse me, but like I said, I was just shuffling, and on the bottom of the deck, spirit is speaking like crazy, like this is your life purpose, bottom of the deck of this one says, um, yeah, this one says major contract success, so I don't know who you are, okay? Listen, I'm just the messenger, okay? You take what resonates, leave what doesn't. This message is not going to be for everybody. This is somebody in particular who's literally going to be as big as Beyonce or as big as Destiny's Child if you're collaborating with other individuals, okay? Some of you guys are single artists, independent artists. Others of you are, like I said, in a group, right? Like, like Destiny's Child and such. So yeah, there's a major contract a lot of success heading towards you. A lot of recognition. I'm hearing it's time. If this message is going to resonate with you, if it already does, because you know, you just always know, guys, when you know the reading is for you, there's an intuitive nudge as to why you came to watch this live, as to why you came, let's say you're watching it pre-recorded, whatever it is, let your intuition guide you, okay? Um, most definitely. And don't forget to like this video, guys. Give it a thumbs up if this is you, Okay. Just gotta moisturize, okay? Miss Independent. Yeah, somebody here independent, all right? So, let me just take a sip of my tea. Woo, we got independent artists in the house, beautiful. So yeah, this is your life purpose. You know this is your life purpose. Six of Wands on the bottom. What more do we need to say? I just want to be successful, right? You're about to be successful. You're getting what you wanted to be. This is something you've always wanted to be, okay? I'm seeing you get recognition, victory, rewards, awards, um, a lot of subscribers, a lot of fans, okay? This is, this is definitely a music industry thing, but this is for some. For some of you, if this isn't music, then like you're just about to be a legend at something here, okay? But I'm really getting like an artist, right? Like that's why I kept seeing Beyonce. I kept seeing a whole bunch of different anomalies, really. Um, I'm going to be using the Purpose uh, Oracle deck, but let's just start with Tarot, okay? We have the Ace of Pentacles with the Six of Wands. So definitely there is some sort of contract. There's a huge major opportunity. Whenever this is coming, okay, um, this is going to be major, guys. Like, that's it. You're going to be put on a high horse here. We have the Emperor Aries energy, okay? So like I said, that big boss energy. You're making moves. You're taking action towards your dreams. You're not settling for anything less than what you deserve. And I'm really seeing you in your Emperor energy. Like, you're just owning it, okay? Um, for some of you guys, this could be a boss here. Somebody older than you may offer you this opportunity, this authority, somebody in position, okay? So somebody already in a position to give you an opportunity may give this to you, or this is just you um, born. Yeah, it's like you were meant to lead. Yeah, you're being called to lead and to, yeah, a lot of people are meant to follow you, okay? You're, you're meant to be a natural born leader here, okay, for sure, whether you're an emperor or or an empress, masculine or feminine energy, okay? Oh, 
Hi guys, welcome everybody. Hey, where my legends at? Where my legends at? So you could be an air sign here, okay? This could be, like I said, this is singing. This has to do with your voice, right? Let's get into this. Oof, you about to feel that anxiety. Some of you guys already feel destiny calling you. You already feeling destiny calling you, don't you? Yeah, somebody here is feeling the shift. You feel destiny calling. You feel a shift in the air. It's like, you know something's coming. You may be dreaming about it or you're feeling it. <clears throat> you may be having symptoms like feeling anxiety, feeling like um, some of you guys have been anxious. Like, when is this coming? When is this going to happen? Okay, this is coming fast. This is the wheel of fortune there's a lot of luck involved this is this is shifting okay so yeah do not miss this opportunity says spirit okay just it do not be distracted this is not the time to be distracted because you could lose this opportunity okay you could be a water sign here pisces cancer scorpio Yeah, I'm just hearing good news. There's going to be some type of good news coming towards you. So anyways, this is it, whoever you are, okay? Um, I'm really excited for you. Ancestor Spirit Guides of the Highest White Light. Continue telling me about this artist here. Okay, so um, I'm channeling, I don't know if you know Lupe Fiasco, okay? He's an artist, rapper here. Um, you could be a rapper watching, but... If you know Lupe Fiasco, then that's even like an anomaly for you, to, like a specific message. Because I'm getting that song, Superstar. Yeah, it's a song, Superstar, by Lupe. Okay, it goes, If you are what you say you are, a superstar. Right? So I feel like you're not just any star. You're a superstar. Whoever I'm talking to, you're going to blow up big. This is big. You're a superstar. Okay? You're a super saying you're not just a typical artist okay you're not a mumble rapper over here we're talking about a legend you're not just you don't just have any voice you have a beyonce you have a my myara carey you have like a very beautiful kind of voice right obviously i don't want to compare you to any artist because you are your individual self but i'm just giving you examples of maybe these are artists that you look up to as well yesenia ramos welcome to becoming a magician my love thank you for becoming a member Yesenia. Okay. Guys, if you would like to donate to my channel, please do so through my Cash App, PayPal, or this um, YouTube sticker is here. Okay. Yeah. Somebody about to be in that Hall of Fame. Your name going to be in Hollywood. Yeah. I should put Hollywood on the title. Hollywood. Hall of Fame. Exactly. Like I said, I don't know. This is such a major opportunity. This is a blessing. Okay. This is your gift. This is your blessing, and you're going to share this gift with the world as well, okay? Ten of Wands. It's been hard. Some of you guys have really been battling a lot of psychic battles here. There's been a lot of things that have been holding you back or making you feel burdensome, right? Um, I feel like, you know, you could be a Capricorn here, okay? Somebody could be an Aries Capricorn. These are the energies coming through. I heard Sagittarius. But there's been some type of devil around you, right? There's been a lot of manipulation, a lot of obstacles, a lot of addictions that you've had to... Yeah, yeah, look, Sagittarius on the bottom, but you're an earth angel here. Whatever you're doing is divine. Like, you're an earth angel, you're very divine, and I feel like you've been under attack. A lot of times you've been under spiritual attack here by negative forces and negative energies and entities, for sure. Trust me, whoever this message is for, I'm speaking the truth right now. Ten of Wands. There's just a lot of burdens from the past that try to hold you back from this opportunity. But everything here has given you the lessons for this brand new opportunity. It's like spirit has been telling you, be patient. You've been wanting to push forward. You've been pushing forward with so many obstacles, with so many burdens, with just so much overwhelmingness that it's like I finally see some type of peace and patience coming together, like divine timing, everything is happening now. And it's right now that you're being called for this angel here. You could be very spiritual, but you see this brand new path. This is your path to, the, to your happiness, to the sun. You could be a Leo. 
but you're going towards the sun here. Okay, whatever you're doing, it's divine. It's divinely orchestrated. The world. Ooh, I'm telling you, you're really going to be recognized by the world. I'm getting Michael Jackson vibes. Okay, Jackson. A very big artist, okay? You may even become bigger than them. I don't freaking know. You would know your talent, your abilities, your potential. It's time to celebrate. I see a lot of people celebrating you. I see the whole world celebrating you. Literally. I'm seeing you blowing up all over online because the world to me is the internet card. So it's like, I don't know, you blowing up all over the internet. I don't know if your songs, your videos, whatever it is, something's viral, and it's like all of a sudden online, a lot of people are celebrating you. You're getting more followers, subscribers, messages, loves, fans. Okay, this is a big fan base. But like where you're going to be known throughout many cultures, throughout many continents, throughout many parts of the world. Thank you, XVII, for your donation, love. Many blessings. So, yeah, let's continue here. I definitely see you so much. Like, you're just literally being celebrated. Oh, the Eight of Wands. This is coming fast, guys. This is coming very fast. This could come in the form of a message or a phone call, these news. Hey, Bad Brad. Thank you so much for your donation. Very glad to see you here, okay? Hey, you could be the next big artist. I sure definitely know you got some talent out there. Okay, this is crazy, guys. I'm feeling this energy. It's like it's time. I just feel like the suspense is about to be over, okay? It's about to be over. Yeah, you've been stuck in something, okay? It's like you've held yourself back. You've, sel you've self-sabotaged yourself because there were times in your life you felt insecure about your talent, your gift, or your position. But I'm seeing God positioning you. It's like God is positioning you in the in where you're supposed to be. God is putting you in the throne. God is positioning you, giving you your throne where you belong, okay? You a boss now. I'm hearing that Cardi B song, Making Money Moves, okay? You making money moves, and something's coming very fast. Like, the energy's gaining momentum. Even if it feels like nothing's happening behind the scenes, your angels are working with you. Because, again, maybe there's a... Obviously, the industry we know could be very, like, fucked up, the music industry. So if you're scared about that, just know that, like, you know... You're always divinely guided by your angels. Listen to them. Obviously, you know, be careful of this devilistic energies here. <clears throat> I'll get more clarification into that, but this is what's coming through. I just see so much celebration, the world celebrating you, okay? There was a lack of insecurity, but it's like you're, you're breaking that. Yeah, there was, for some of you, there was spell work, okay? Won't lie. There was spell work. Yeah, look, you were holding back your talent. It could have been due to money, finances, stability. You didn't feel stable enough. You kept hiding the sun from yourself, knowing that you were the star. You could be a Leo here, okay? You have a certain strength. Spirit says you have a certain strength. You have a certain gift. You have a certain way with people, okay? It's your strength. It's your story. You're about to get happiness here, for sure. And for some of you, this is something you've wanted to do since you were six years old. Okay. Clarify this Capricorn devil energy here. Clarify the devil. Okay, so we have the five of cups here. With the hermit Virgo energy. So I don't know what was happening. Yeah, the three of wands. Guys, this is coming fast. This could come in three weeks, three months. Okay. Definitely this is not a three years. Because, like, this could be three years for one person, but I'm not getting that. This is coming soon with that eight of wands. This is happening soon. It could be three weeks, three months. Um, again, divine timing is at play here. I'm only giving my assumptions through this reading, but time is whatever, right? It's it's timeless. Um, we have the high priestess. Follow your intuition here. You could be a Pisces, okay? Look, the magician. Yeah, guys, there was a lot of spell work being done on you here. Somebody was trying to block your creativity. Trust me, there was some type of um, spell work here. Wow, Tyler Brown. Thank you so much for your kind donation, Tyler. Many blessings to you, my love. So with the Five of Cups and the Hermit unfalling under the devil energy, 
honestly, I'm really getting here that you've held with so much depression issues. It's like you fought depression, sadness. You've had, you had to cloak yourself from the devil, from vampiristic energies. It's like there was a lot of people um, trying to take from your energy, right? Trying to feed off your energy. And it left you very drained. It left you very depressed. It left you having to cloak yourself which goes back to a video I did a few days ago called God Hates You in Plain Sight, okay? So that may have resonated with you. If you haven't watched that reading, guys, go watch that reading that says God has hit you in plain sight because I do see God had to hit you with this hermit, okay? There's a lot of cloaking. Jedi, thank you. Jedi, stay high. <laughs> thank you for your donation, Jedi. Hey, you better stay high. Exactly. You guys are flying new heights, flying high. You're reckless. Coaching, thank you so much for your donation. So, really, what I'm getting here is something was cloaked for for this enemy, for this vampiristic energy doesn't take away from you. And a lot of people did drain you. A lot of people manipulated you, hurt you, tried to bind you. Um, definitely seeing that here. God's coherent creation, thank you so much for your donation, my love. It's like... It's like a lot of people from your past were doing this to you. And I'm getting like, you're a light worker. You went through a lot of battles and shadow work and demons. You fought a lot of demons, but you won the war. Okay. Whatever spiritual attack you were under, or you're still under, you're going to, you're going to, you're going to win. Okay. You're going to conquer this battle or this war spiritually. Trust me, because what I'm seeing here is you're a light worker. You're a light bringer, right? And you probably like to spend a lot of time by yourself. Right. You maybe not were had a period in your life where you didn't even want to go outside. You didn't feel enthusiastic about your career anymore. You could have even procrastinated. This was because somebody here had to do whoever this message is for. This person here had to do shadow work. You faced your demons and you're being congratulated because you faced something that was so horrific for you. I feel here. It was such a hard struggle. You had to go within and you won the battle. Yeah, I'm getting here like at some point in your life, you became your worst enemy. Magic, okay? Somebody had put some type of spell work on you here. But there was divine intervention. The angels intervene each and every time. These vampire energies, these lower frequency vibrations try to drain you and take from you. So yeah, you retreated or something. You've been working on this like very hushly. Yeah, seven of swords. You've been, you've been literally working on this very silently because of this other energies around you, I feel, that are toxic. Some of you guys here really have been living around a lot of toxic people. Look, seven of swords, okay? So somebody definitely here tried to stop your destiny. They try to block your path. They did spell work on you. I'm not going to lie, okay? But there was a divine intervention. It's like this is the time. Maybe you were under spell work, okay? For three years to three months or several years. But now is the time where the angels are intervening and they're like, no more. This is the time where mm -hmm. you're going to blow up. This is the time where you're going to get your blessing. Because somebody here thought that they can um, get away. It could have been a Virgo here or a Gemini. Someone thought that they could get away with something. Steal your gifts, steal your shine, steal your energy. I'm definitely seeing somebody wanting to take your shine, take your energy, take your spot. But they can't. Dude, you want to know why? Because you're the fucking star. You could be an Aquarius. You're the fucking star. You're the one with options. People try to confuse you, but you always remain the same. You never changed. You know, you changed spiritually in many ways. But you, your authenticity, who you knew, your talents, your beliefs, that shit never changed. This is you. You're the star. You're the healer. You're the star seed. You're the light worker. I'm telling you, the six of wands and the star, this keeps coming up in all of the readings that I have been doing. But I'm finally getting that like, this is the finale. This is, you're closing out a cycle. You're leaving something behind. You're entering a new face in your life where there's just a lot of rewards, a lot of celebration. Why? Well, you've done the inner work. You've healed yourself. You've remained hopeful. This is your wish. This is your wish fulfillment. You've remained faithful in God and the universe. You knew this shit was coming. All right? I heard August. For some of you, this may happen in August, okay?
your authenticity is going to be seen here or is being seen. There could already be somebody watching you because I have that emperor there. Clarify the, uh, clarify the emperor. Yeah, some of you guys are going to be asked to travel. Whoever this message is for, yeah, you're about to be fucking happy. And you're about to get that bag. You're about to get that money too. Facts. 576 people in here, guys. Let's give this video a thumbs up, okay, if this resonates. Yeah, somebody here is hurt. They want revenge. I feel like you channel whatever pain you go through, you channel it through music. It's your pain that has made you strong. It's your pain that has made you an amazing lyricist, okay? You are a healer. You heal through your music. You heal people's pain. You could write a lot of love songs or just a lot of, like, struggles. I'm hearing you talk about the struggle, okay? You're talking about that pain. You're talking about that struggle, all right? And that's what's going to make you shine. Talking about all that shit you've been through while you was growing up. All those obstacles that were in the way. All those roadblocks. Okay? I'm also hearing you a heartbreaker. So you could be very attractive here. Like people feel like you're a heartbreaker. Yeah, four of swords. But you, you healed. Okay? It's like you're healing from a heartbreak or you've healed from a heartbreak. You took your time, high priestess. You started learning tarot. Or um, you started listening to your intuition. You started receiving dreams, downloads from spirit about where you were headed. Yeah, death. You could be a Scorpio or a Leo. Cancer. Yeah. It's like you're no longer going to believe whatever that old belief was. And you're going to believe in yourself. You're starting to believe in yourself. You're, you're seeing a talent here. You're seeing your talents. People are seeing you. And you're very spiritual, very intuitive here, for sure. Tell me about this artist spirit. What else? Can, yeah, the lovers. There's going to need to be a decision. It may have to do with relocation. You may have to physically or spiritually or emotionally move away from somebody. That's the tower. Guys, this is happening unexpectedly. Somebody's about to go viral. Listen. Listen. Listen up, listen up, whoever the hell you are, somebody's about to go viral, all right? It's like a tower. This is like unexpectedly, you're going to be put on the spot. You're going to need to make a decision, okay? Remember, this is divinely orchestrated. I feel like your ancestors, spirit guides are literally guiding you somewhere. I see a lot of angels guiding you somewhere. So this is powerful because I feel like when angels guide you somewhere, it's because they know that you're needed, okay, as a light worker. So they're kind of helping you with this with this dream here. Yeah, something is happening. Like, you might just wake up out of nowhere and have, like, I don't know, 43 million views on your videos, on your music. I don't know. I'm seeing you suddenly wake up, and you're suddenly known viral, like, everywhere in every country, every state. You just wake up, and there's so many messages. Oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh, I love your music. I love this. Fans, people. A lot of opportunities, okay? A lot of opportunities are going to come here. You're being congratulated, okay? I'm telling you. This is going to happen unexpectedly. That's the truth. That's the truth. You speak truth, okay? It's like in your music, you speak truth. Yeah, the Hierophant. So there's a label here that's watching you, or they're going to offer you something, okay? I also feel like this is God's plan. The Hierophant is giving me God's plan, okay? This has been God's plan all along. Your voice is powerful. You break you break chains when you speak. Look, the nine of things. Yeah, things will slow down for you. It's like no matter no matter who tried to delay it due to witchcraft, there was a lot of people trying to delay it. They try to delay from this process, but it's like you're some type of guru. I don't know. You're some type of healer. You're some type of guru here. You understand? With this thing here, you could be in a twin flame connection. That's random, but I don't know if you resonate with that. But it's like you're highly, highly, you could have been re very religious and then turned to be very spiritual. But it's like no matter who delayed you, you kept your faith. You kept believing in God. You kept believing in a higher power. And because you kept believing in that higher power, no matter who tried to slow you down, this nine of pentacles kept moving. Persistence. It was your persistence. Okay. You kept going. So keep going because it's going to blow up. Okay. Sun God, seven Apollo. Thank you for your donation, my love. All right. 
Thank you, Aaron, for your donation. Aaron Lowe. Many blessings, guys. All right. I also see here... Let's see what's this magician. Yeah, look, somebody's trying to block your blessings. They could have done this in the past or this could be right now. But it's like somebody doesn't want you to see. There were people in your life that didn't want you to see your gift. They didn't want you to see your blessing. They were blocking this spiritually with magic. They wanted to steal your gift, your energy, your power. Knowing that you had it all. Guys, you have all the tools that you need to make this happen. You don't need nothing else. Some of you guys are waiting for the perfect moment. No, you don't. You don't need nothing else. Do not miss this opportunity because the Four of Cups keeps showing up. All right? Stand your ground. You're highly protected during this period of time. Because time for victory and success. Time for growth. Time to blow up. Time for you to be the sun. Ten of Swords. Okay? Be careful about somebody backstabbing you, trying to plot a murder here. Okay? I already did a video on that. If this message resonates with you, if you feel somebody's out to get you, trying to harm you because you're about to blow up and become successful... Watch that video that I called somebody's trying to murder you, okay? Uh, point blank period here. We raw with it. We raw with it, okay? So, yeah, you're highly protected. This is raw, okay? I see sun raw protecting you. You could be ancient Egyptian blood here, or you could actually be from Egypt, but I'm seeing raw, okay? It's, this may happen in day. Like when you wake up during the day, you may just see this message. Something about the day, okay? Um, I heard 4 p.m., or this could happen uh, 6 a.m., but I'm getting raw energy here, okay? Like, you're highly protected by Sun Raw. Ace of Cups, exactly. Woof, watching you. A lot of people watching you right now, okay? Somebody, that this person is watching you. They're going to give you this blessing. There's somebody already got, that got their eyes on you. They see your talent. Ace of Wands, they think you're very creative. They think you're very creative. Look, collaboration, exactly. Guys, I'm telling you. I'm seeing like the Beyonce, Destiny's Child here collaboration. Six of yeah, somebody's gonna give you something. They're gonna offer you a collaboration here. Okay, you may join a group of three people if you're independent by yourself. That they may just make you sign a contract. Okay, because I'm seeing a contract here, collaboration. Okay, somebody's gonna give you something because they see that you're a being of service. Um, yeah, you you like to give a lot. Oof, look what fell out. Look what fell out. Oh, my gosh. Hold on. I need some tea. I need to calm down. Mm. Oh, this is so good. Guys, this reading cannot get any better. Okay? We have 731 people here. Wow. Guys, let's get 731 likes here. How about that? Where's that support? Huh? Okay, if this message is resonating right now, guys, give this message a thumbs up. Thank you for your donations ahead of time. Okay, thank you, Jennifer Davis, for your donation. So anyways, yeah, I feel like some of you guys were stuck, okay, but then you were enlightened about where you were supposed to go, where you were heading, all right? Someone might have thought here, there could have been like an age issue that was holding you back. Whatever it is, okay, I see you getting that inheritance. There's a major contract here. I'm seeing from um, 10,000 all the way to 10 million or 100 million, whatever this is, okay? This is the power of 10. And that's the empress energy. Like I said, you're in that divine. Even if you're a male or female, you are the empress, right? So you are in this energy of creating. And there's something that you're going to give birth to, which is this music. I don't know if you're working on a project now. You're, gi you're giving birth to this idea, to this project, to this EP, to this album. I don't know. You're giving birth to it. And it's going to be an overflow of abundance when it does. It's just going to be an overflow of abundance. Unstoppable force. You understand? Unstoppable force of abundance coming towards you. Like it's just going to be raining money. Understand? Raining money. Because you're so creative. It's like you're so creative. There's so many ideas. Yeah, your creativity is phenomenal. It's meant to shine. It's just, it's something about the way that you think, the way that you are, the way that you write, the way that you sing. I don't know. You're a blessing. And I feel like, yeah, you're going to give birth to a lot of blessings here. 
okay? Somebody might actually, like, be pregnant, all right, right now. And once you give birth to your child, you're going to be off of this. That's for somebody out there. But look, this is inheritance right here. This is generational. You're breaking generational curses while you're getting generational wealth. So your kids and your kids' kids are going to have money here, obviously, if you are able to manage your money and everything. I see you not struggling with money anymore, okay? I see you being able to lend to charity to help your family, your loved ones, okay? I see you spoiling your kids, um, spoiling your, your wife, your husband, whatever. I also do have the Empress and the Emperor. So like I said, your Divine Masculine and your Divine Feminine energy is very balanced. But for some of you, because we have the lovers too... You could be in a twin flame connection and you might meet this person while you're, you know, while you're a celebrity out there. OK. Wow. So, yeah, let's look here. This is already clarifying that you're getting that major contract. There's a major contract here. Trust me, you're going to get that bag. You're going to get that money. There's a major contract of success here. Yeah, some of you guys are stressed. I don't know. Spirit saying there's no need to stress about money. You're not going to have to stress about money. You're not going to have to stress about anything else. Obviously, it's not like money solves everything or fame solves everything. Obviously, after that, you're still going to have your own shadow work, your own things, right? Because we're never, we're never done growing spiritually and healing. But I feel like you have a story. You conquered something very, um, very demonic, something like that was very major to conquer but you conquered it i don't know you defeated some type of dragon demon or something and you're getting blessed and i really get like you're not going to be stressed okay because you've been stressing a lot about your life your stability and things like that you're going to meet a lot more people says spirit now entrepreneur can't make it up can't make it up you're growing your own business here okay you're becoming your own independent artist for some of you for some of you you're you know you're you're entrepreneur here you're hustling. You're focused on the money. You're focused in your dream. You're a goddess, right? That's the divine feminine energy. You're a goddess. You're tapping into your energy, right? It's like you finally graduated to that empress energy. You're finally realizing all that you have to give to the world, how creative you are, how abundant you are. And this is something you're attracting. I feel like you've been working very silently. You're not really going all crazy about this. So I feel like, you know, um, there's something about you being very humble here. The goddess. Yeah, you goddess. Light worker. Like I keep saying, you're a beautiful light worker. Your music is very healing to people. Especially maybe like people that are like depressed or something like that. For some of you, okay? Whoever this message is for. Thank you guys for your likes, for your donations, your support. You guys are amazing as always, truly. I appreciate each and every one of you. Oh, she said her ears are on fire. Sh chill. That's verification. Childhood trauma. Exactly. You were dealing with something that you've triumphed and you've and you've won. You've defeated some type of monster and you got victory. You're about to be worldly renounced, a superstar. Everybody's going to know your name. Your name is going to be known all over. OK, this is like a legend. Right. So. Everybody know who Beyonce is. Everybody know who Jay-Z is. Everybody know who Michael Jackson is. Well, everybody's going to know who the hell you are too. Right? If that's you, don't forget to like this video, guys, to support this channel because I'm obviously delivering you this prophetic message. If it resonates, all you got to do is like this video. Okay? And if you feel called to donate, thank you so much ahead of time. You were dealing with a lot of narcissistical people in your life, in your childhood that you had to protect your energy from. Right? You had to protect your energy from a lot of people around you that might have molested you, raped you, hurt you in some sort of way. There was some sort of childhood trauma. This could have been you dealing with poverty, not having a father, not having a mother, not having parents, not having love. Um, whatever this situation was for you, this childhood trauma has literally made you a light worker, has made you a goddess, has made you who you are today. Okay, because now you understand people, right? narcissist yeah you're moving away from these narcissists like literally that's that that's that um devil energy there leadership what did i just say what did i just say i'm also hearing like be receptive to receive right 
you're always hustling, going towards like the emperor takes action. But remember to be the empress. It's time to receive now, okay? Yeah, some of you guys are building an empire here. If you're, if I, this is somebody here that's not married, okay? You're gonna meet somebody here and like you're gonna, you're building an empire like Jay Z and Beyonce, like an empire like that. But look, leadership. That's the emperor. He's a leader. So you're a leader. You're being called. Yeah, new love is coming. For someone, this is this is a new lover that's entering your life who's going to be like your soulmate twin flame here. Wow, we have celebrity on the bottom of the deck. Can't make it up, guys. Celebrity, who are you? Who are you? Because seriously, you're going to be on the spotlight. Are you ready? Get ready. Do not be scared. This shit was written this way. This shit is for you. I don't feel this person is scared, by the way. You might be stressed right now. Like this contract, I'm hearing the contract may stress you out. Ask for guidance from your spirit guides or whatever. All right. Obviously, read every fine print in the contract. Get a lawyer if you need to. You know, all that kind of stuff, right? But I feel like you're very much guided here by a higher power. Very, very much, okay? <clears throat> Someone here dealt with a divorce before. But you're a celebrity. You're about to step into fame. And I've been saying this for the longest since I started my channel, but I feel like... Since we're approaching 2022 and there's a shift in the air, now, like, I feel like a lot of people who are being called to their purpose, like, they're awakening, right? This is somebody who woke, this is somebody who knows what there is. They've been working on this crap, right? You've been working on it. Now is the time to get this um, contract and it's going to be successful. So there's nothing to stress. No matter what, there, you're already going to be successful, okay? This is the way it is. This is written. You can't stop it. This is unstoppable force. We already had the Wheel of Fortune. You are unique, okay? And your unique music, it's what's going to stand out. Nobody raps like you. Nobody sing like you. Nobody, you know, whatever this artist is, nobody do it like you. Yeah, especially because nobody has the wisdom that you have, collective. Nobody has the wisdom that you have. There's some sort of trauma, devils, like I said, war, spiritual war, spiritual attacks. You have so much to teach the world with all that you learned, because you still, no matter how much darkness you dealt with, you still remain light. You still followed your calling. You still waited for that hope, that light at the end of the tunnel. Okay? You seeked for your own guidance and spirit and not from outsiders, which is why you're being celebrated. Okay? Beautiful. Beautiful. There's so much that you have to share. Yes, yeah, someone here had gone to jail before secretly seen somebody else this one don't belong in this deck okay we have deleted messages secrets and do not be afraid to be yourself all right do not be afraid to be yourself please remain authentic please be yourself um there's someone here spirit is saying that is doing dirty work around you somebody's deleting messages they're talking about you. They're deleting messages, okay? There's some type of secret there that you have to look into. Something about some, some message being deleted. There's a secret. Somebody's not telling you. They may be trying to, like, spread your rumors, gossip about you. Just be careful with that. The tables are about to turn, my love. God is serving you. God is preparing you a table for your where your enemies won't be able to eat with you. They can't come to it. Yeah, look, artist. You're a singer, you're a beat maker, you're an actor, whatever, okay? But this is an artist here. You're a public speaker, yeah. Your throat chakra. They doubted you, but now they're about to see the truth. They doubted you, and now they're, you're publicly about to be blessed. They doubted you, and now you're publicly about to be blessed. If that resonates with you, please give this video a thumbs up, guys. Thank you for your support, your donations, your likes. You guys are amazing, okay? This is you, publicly recognized, darling. <laughs> yeah, traveling the world. Exactly, guys. The Spirit is already giving you the double confirmation here. Look, this is the world card. I already said some of you guys are going to be traveling, no, be known around the world. You're going to get to tour, go on tour, and travel all over the world. People all over the world from the UK and all these other areas, okay? They're going to know about you. But you are going to need to make a decision here, Spirit says. So be ready when you need to make it. We have enemies. 
Like I said, there's something about secrets, deleted messages. There's some enemies around you. Okay, so be careful. Um, follow your intuition. You have a feeling about who this may be. You know who this is. You have a deep knowing. All right, so um, maybe like you need to pray or connect to your to your higher self here. Yeah, the tables have turned. So your enemies are about to see how the tables have turned. Yeah, because they've been obsessed with your destiny here. They've been obsessed with destroying your life and your destiny, says Spirit. And then we have financial issues. No more financial issues to whoever this message is for. Trust me, we already have the Ten of Pentacles. That's all I need. I will be pulling more money cards, but trust me, like, you good. Yeah. Then we have music. Can't make it up, guys. This is to do with music. Like I said, who are you? It's you. You're going to be the biggest artist, okay? The biggest artist in the world. You're the next Beyonce. You're the next Jay-Z, okay? Whatever or whatever other artist. I'm only using this two as an example. Please, let's not um, judge, okay? Brandy, thank you so much for your donation, love. Many blessings to you. Thank you, everyone, who is supporting my channel. If anyone else would like to donate to my Cash App or PayPal, all right, that information is down below. But yeah, I'm getting like, somebody's literally about to be like, exactly. You're about to be way bigger than these artists. Whoever you are, it's like, they don't even know you. You understand? They they're good. they have no idea. Now they're about to come out. It's like you came out of nowhere. And you're going to get this fame fast. Everything's going to blow up fast, okay? It's like you drop one song or a holy P, whatever it is. And all of a sudden, it, everything goes so fast. You suddenly wake up and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm like super famous and I'm a freaking legend in like seven days or in one day, like whatever this is, it's fast. It's unexpected, but but it's everything that you've expected and more because you've known about this. You prayed about this. It's everything that you've expected and more. Okay. Spirit says you have no idea how much I'm about to bless you right now, but your enemies are about to see you publicly get blessed. And that's already a blessing in itself because they doubted you. They made fun of you, period, period, point blank. So I'm going to pull some of these cards, okay? Yeah, I'm getting, I feel it coming, baby. I feel it coming. You feel it coming. Somebody feel it coming. Watch your back, okay? Watch your back. I feel it coming, baby. Feel it coming. Yeah, bottom of the deck, we have envy. I just said, watch your back. Look, we have envy. There's a woman or a man that's jealous of your success. Okay? It says, you, others could be envying your success. Be careful who you trust with money matters. So be careful who you trust with money at this time, with somebody handling your money. Be careful who you tell this contract to. Someone here is not going to be too happy about this. So you need to be aware about who these people are, right? Like you can't just go tell somebody, oh my God, I got signed. Be careful who you tell these news to, okay? Or, oh my God, I'm going viral. Even though you're about to be publicly blessed, right? I feel like some people going to be mad, okay? They mad because they know this was your destiny. You were born to shine, okay? Trust. So envy. Some people here are envious of your beauty, says spirit. They're envious of your beauty, of your success. It's like you're beautiful, you're hot, you're sexy, you're talented. You're unique, you're authentic, you're raw. Someone here likes to wear a leather jacket. Okay, there's a female here that likes to wear a leather jacket or a male. You could also like to wear like pins on your jackets like she's wearing. Yeah, somebody jealous about your beauty, your talents, your success. Yeah, look, voice. Ooh, somebody just went to the studio. Somebody's going to the studio here. Spirit's saying, you went to the studio. You're recording your music already. Some of you guys are going to the studio. Others of you guys have your own studio at home. Okay? Like, you record in your own house. Wow. All right, keep going. Yeah, this is your life purpose. This is your life purpose. So there's no need to hate. There's no need to hate because this is a purpose. All right. You're manifesting this, says spirit. You're manifesting this. 
Charity. I told you, charity. Somebody's going to help you out. There's somebody that sees that you, that they're going to help you out, okay? They're going to donate something. But I'm also getting like, you're a powerful humanitarian. You're a light worker. And your purpose is also to give to the world. This is how you're going to give back. This is how you're going to give back through your beauty. You bring beauty through your music, okay? Um, this is how you're going to give back to the world. I also see somebody in the future being so known. Um, like if you guys remember that time Michael Jackson traveled to Africa and he was like singing and dancing with all those boys and girls, I feel like that's going to be you too. Like you're going to go around the world, travel, and um, <clears throat> you're going to donate and help kids and things like that. We have Planner. Oof, trust me, things are about to get busy. Writer, you write your own lyrics here, okay? You write your own lyrics. This is a writer here. You write your own lyrics. You also could write books here, okay? You're just a beautiful, prolific writer. Mm -hmm. Very creative writer. But listen, I'm getting so many downloads. I need to calm down. Um, I'm getting like a planner here. Like, you're going to have to plan, get your stuff situated, because there's so many events that are going to come through. You're going to get invited a lot, okay, to, with other artists for charity um, conventions and things like that. Uh, I'm also hearing like you're going to go through some sort of glow up. People are going to see your beauty shine and things like that. Okay. If you guys remember when Cardi B got her teeth done. Okay. Something like that. Like you might get your teeth done or change your hair, change your style, buy better clothes. With the planner, it's like you're, you're going to need to get organized because there's a lot to plan. There's a lot of you're going to be booked. Period. You're going to be booked. You're going to be torn. You're going to be booked. You're going to be performing. You're going to need to plan a lot here. Okay? Somebody might invite you to record with them or um, to a charity event here. Okay? But we have writer. So you definitely a writer here. And there's change coming to your life. Look, we have the seasons. Okay? All seasons change, right? But this is coming now. Someone here might play football or sport too as well, like just for fun or something. Tell me more about this artist spirit. Control. Control. You might have wanted to control things here. I'm getting like you rescue people with your music. Like you rescued yourself and God is going to rescue you now. You've rescued so many people with your writing, with your music. Um, you let go. This is somebody that's surrendering control and giving it to God. Look, you about to blow up on social media. See, this is the media. You're meant to be on TV. You're meant to be on the radio, on television, magazines. Oh my gosh, guys, who are you? You're literally about to be on magazines. I'm hearing Vogue, like all magazines. You're literally about to be, um, going to podcasts, radios, people going to interview you. This is like, that's what it felt under planning. It felt right on their planning. So you're going to have to plan a lot. You, I see somebody going to a podcast as well, being asked to speak or to sing somewhere. Okay. Like I said, there's a lot of activities coming with the media. The media is going to know you, the radio, the TV, magazine. So you may have to literally for those three have to set up events. Like when you're going to go and do this, get organized is what spirit is saying. Okay. <clears throat> you're going to be planning events. This is something you've never done before, obviously. So you're just getting excited here. Your social media is also going to change here. Okay, yeah, this, guys, look, bottom of the deck, partnership. I told you, there's a there's an offer, there's a partnership. Somebody's going to give you a contract or offer you partnership. You may receive money or an offer from someone you know. So this is somebody you know already for some of you. This is somebody that you, that, may, that you may follow on social media or may follow you or is looking at your social media. Yeah, I'm seeing somebody receive a yeah, promoter. There's a DJ here. You could also be a DJ, but I'm getting like. There's a promoter. Somebody wants to promote your music. OK, somebody wants to promote your music out there. They might invite you to like a night event, to a club, to sing or perform at a club. I see somebody performing at a, yeah, like a club or something. Something with the night, okay? Thank you guys for your donations and your likes. Thank you for your support. Soraya, thank you so much for your donation, love. Oop, hold on. This is such a straightforward, very specific reading though, right? Okay, tell me more, spirit. Tell me more. 
Helper. Exactly. You're a helper. You like to help people. You know what I'm also getting here? This is There's somebody here that's literally about to blow up. It's like you work in the hospitality industry right now. Right now, let's say you're not famous, right? Right now, you're working maybe as like um, a bartender. You could be working at a Starbucks. You could be working as a, as a waitress because this is somebody that's working like a regular nine to five. Like people underestimated you. They were just like, oh, but weren't you that girl or that guy who served iced coffees at Starbucks? Right. And now suddenly, like the whole freaking social media knows who the hell you are. Where did she come from? Where did he come from? That's what I'm hearing. OK, because it's like it was unexpected. Some of you guys were trying to like pay your college uh, tuition and things like that through this job. I'm seeing beer. Someone here is going from bartender to fucking legend. OK, you work in the hospitality here. And somebody's going to help you a, a hand. Somebody's going to give you a hand. There's a helper that's coming. Somebody's trying to literally give you a hand here. Okay, so accept this help. This person is the one that's going to help you. Yeah, persistence. I already said this. The Knight of Pentacles. You kept going. You kept working on it. Day and night. You kept going. Thank you so much, Cheryl, for your donation. Okay, and because of your persistence, now... Now you finally, yeah, I'm, I'm seeing paparazzi, basically. I'm your biggest star, I'll follow you until you love me, papa, paparazzi. Your hard work is required. So remember, this is going to be a lot of hard work. Spirit saying you need to prepare yourself. Because it is going to be a lot of hard work um, attending all these parties. Look, we got luck, okay? Mm -hmm. There's a lucky opportunity, guys. This is your lucky chance. This is your lucky opportunity. You're going to be very stable, very prosperous. Look at all these gold, okay? You're going to have that gold. Your music is gold. What I'm also getting here is like the Golden Globes, okay? Something about the Golden Globes. Um, What else do I have here? With the Persistent card, my nose keeps itching me, so I, it happens when I channel. I'm not actually like pulling out a booger or something. <laughs> Just letting you know. Um... Your efforts have not gone unnoticed. Success is just around the corner. Wow. Did you hear that? Success is around the corner. Like I said, this is happening right now. This is around the corner for somebody. Do not forget me if I gave you this reading and you about to blow up, guys. Don't freaking forget me. Listen, your effort has not gone unnoticed. God has watched you work day and night. God has watched you move in silence. The universe has watched you. They're saying, I know you never gave up. I know you were persistent. And now success is just around the corner and this shit is yours. They have not gone unnoticed, collective. It has not gone unnoticed. That is such a beautiful message. Okay? I feel like you've helped a lot of people and you're like, well, when is it my turn? I'm helping a lot of people, but when is it my turn? I feel like that's what you keep asking here. Thank you so much, Fame the Gentleman, for your donation. Thank you, the Empress. Many blessings. So, yeah, let's see. It's because of your persistence. It's because you never gave up. And I feel like I said, you're going to have to work even harder now, right? But you're going to be happy doing what you love. You're going to have to work harder because there's a lot of, you're going to be known in the media now. So, you know, there's levels to ascending. You're going to be all over the magazines, on the radio, on the TV. So... Setbacks. Promoter. I'm telling you, somebody wants to promote your music here. Um, some type of like, yeah, careers in nightlife industry. Some of you guys are strippers. Someone here works as a DJ or as a stripper. Or you have some type of job in, in the nightlife. You may work in like events coordinating here. You could be a promoter. But I'm getting like somebody wants to help you promote your work. 
I'm also getting setbacks. Like God is saying the setbacks had to be there. Okay. Don't lose hope. The, those setbacks were there for all this to occur. So there was never any setback. Okay. That was there to test you. Maybe you felt like you had, a, you, you made many mistakes. Um, you believed in other people and they like, did you wrong? But this was just a setback, okay? This setback was just there to kind of like a slingshot, right? Like it was just there to make you like go even harder, go further in life, okay? There is something about beware here. So you need to beware about someone here. Explorer. The shooting star. Look, I'm telling you, you you're about to travel, okay? Okay. You're going to travel. You're, somebody may go, I don't know, Hollywood, L.A. You're traveling somewhere. You're moving or you're going to sign these contracts in another state, another country. And you're going to be traveling, okay? Your songs bring peace to the world. I'm getting explorer here. So you're going to travel a lot. You're going to get to explore the world. Like whoever you are, you're going to get to explore so much. Your life is going to involve a, a, um, around a lot of adventure. Somebody here likes to go hiking too. It's like you have that Sagittarius energy where you like to travel a lot. See, it says you may need to go wandering and trust the known where the magic lies. There's magic here, okay? Trust where you're being led. You might be like maybe not ready to move, but trust where you're being led. Lola, Rene, thank you so much for your donation, Lola. Rene, many blessings to you guys. Thank you so much, Zozan, for your donation as well, love. Many blessings. If anybody else would like to donate to my Cash App or PayPal, okay, my information is down below. Yeah, somebody here used to work in the, like, as a mechanic, repairing stuff, and now you're blowing up. Entertainer, guys, can't make it up. Look, entertainer. I'm getting Alicia Keys vibe. You may play the piano. We have Alicia Keys here, okay? And she just dropped the album, too. So I'm excited to hear that new Alicia Keys album. But listen, you're an entertainer. You were meant to explore the world, okay? You were meant to travel. You, a lot of people were meant to be around your energy. It says, put yourself out there and bring the best of you so you can get noticed. So somebody is noticing you because you put your music out there. You're finally doing this. You're putting your music out there and somebody is seeing you. You're getting noticed, okay? You're getting noticed, Somebody sees you or somebody's about to see you, okay? I'm telling you. This is the music industry. This is the entertainment industry. You have the talent, okay? Work smart here. You have the talent. I see you, like, explore. I mean, whoa. I see you, like, performing somewhere. You're going to be asked to perform somewhere. It could be the VMAs or something like that. But I'm seeing you, like, wear this beautiful gown and having this beautiful solo moment, it's like you're finally on the stage. You were always meant to be on the stage, okay? Remember that. You were always meant to be on the stage. Yeah. Look, loss. You lost You lost a lot of things here. You could have lost your home. Someone here could have actually experienced a hurricane, a tornado. You had difficulty with money. You had nothing. You were broke. You were nothing. You ain't even had a job. Some of you guys here lost your job, lost your home. You lost everything. Mm -hmm. You went through so many changes and transformations. But guess what? Easy does it. Right here it says, slow and steady, you won the race. No matter how many setbacks you went through, no matter how slow it looked like time went, you won this race. Yeah, some of you guys in the past lost money, lost people because you try to like hustle, okay? You try to like... Um, yeah, you try to hustle, you try to get money quickly here. So this could have been obviously like you being in the streets, you try to scheme people, you try to get rich quick. Okay. But that didn't work for you. You knew that you had to make a change. So that's why you focus on this music. Yeah. You said, yes, take action. Because over here, it says careful not to get involved with any rich, quick schemes. Okay. So this is not everything that comes easy. It's not good. It's what I'm getting here. You know when you, when you work hard for something that when the, the riches comes, it's meant for you.
But when you get money easily, you know, you flipping, you doing whatever, that's easy money. And that's never going to get you where you want to be, right? Anything that comes easy is not good. Yeah, business. Whatever business you had over there in the past, it was not it. Because it was you was trying to get quick money, okay? And that wasn't your path. Investment and spirituality. Yeah, you guys had some sort of spiritual awakening here, okay? You started to tap into tarot card readings. You yourself may read tarot. You may yourself have a tarot channel, okay? You're very spiritual. Some of you guys could have already a spiritual business right now as we speak. Um, but I'm getting like something about you. You realize that you were a healer. You realize that you were a light worker, okay? You started, you were very good at advising people and you started to make a business out of this as well, some of you guys. Um, yeah, I'm getting like you woke up, your spirituality woke you up to who you had to, who you had to be. You went through some type of change, yeah? And then we have investments. So now money's coming, your palm is itching. You're about to receive money, a big investments, okay? It says finances are looking good and growing. So your money's growing. Your finances are about to look good. Excuse me. For some of you, I'm also getting like, it's time to invest here, okay? Somebody may need to get a tower reading here, but I'm getting like, it's time for you to invest in your money, all right? Make those big investments. With this big money coming, make sure you move that money right. You invest that money, okay? Set a strong foundation, Embrace the wisdom of the unknown. You don't know where you're headed. You don't know how things are going to be. But trust where you're being guided. Trust where you're being led. Trust where spirit's trying to take you. Look, reconsider a decision. Okay? You need to reconsider something. If somebody's trying to scheme you for some easy money or something like that, yeah, look, recognition. Do not do it. Let the past go, okay? You need to reconsider a decision from the past. Look, you see this music right here? I'm getting so much. I'm channeling so much right now. Literally, I'm like an open, I don't know, look, celebrate recognition. Look, look, I got to chill. Hold on. Hold on. I have too much. Hold on. Okay. So, Spirit is saying, okay, you've been working. Something from the past is coming back, right? So, this is like, this music stuff goes way back. This is from a past life you've had this. Some of you guys have an ancient soul here, but I'm getting like, your grandpa, your mother, your dad, they could have played the blues, jazz, you know, they could have played this music from the 70s, the 80s, like that kind of music right back then, right? Because we have like this kind of radio. So it's like you were drawn to music from your parents playing music at home or from somebody. It's like you heard the tunes and you knew that this was your path, right? So the past, you're, it's like when you're sitting here, yeah, I told you VMAs or something, the Oscars, look, recognition. Look at this pile of money and this award here. Look at it. It says recognition right there. You see the, the trophy right there. You see you getting your accolades. You are an entertainer. You're about to perform and get a fucking award here whenever you do this. Like, this is huge, right? So what I'm getting here is that you're going to see when, when this moment comes and you're like performing, like let's say, <clears throat> let's say Alicia Keys, right? And you're playing your keys on the stage and you're performing, you're singing. You're going to have this epiphany where you're going to realize that all those lessons, all those setbacks, all those traumas that you went through were to be in that moment right there and now, which is going to be you being recognized and you being celebrated. I'm telling you, there's going to be a lot of celebrate. Look at all these people. As you're performing, people are buying your tickets, you're being booked, you're selling out. Um, people are celebrating you, your family, your friends, okay? They're celebrating you. It says you could be earning or receiving money from something you did in the past. So this could be a song that you had on YouTube or on SoundCloud or whatever, right? Spotify. You had it. This was like five years ago. Somebody's finally going to hear that song that you posted like years ago. Because this is something from the past, right? You invested your time writing. You've invested in the past and now spirit is giving you into the future. Because you persisted. You took your time. And you're getting this recognition. I love this card. Look how beautiful it is. Okay, it says your money is looking good. So chill. Don't worry. Your money looking good. You would earn. Um, you could earn a leadership position or get the recognition you, you deserve. You're about to get a leadership position here. Right? This is like that Drake energy, like big, big boss energy, right? A big, big artist. 
And look at your money piling up. Racks, okay? You got big racks of money here. So step out of that comfort zone. Yes, it feels nice and cozy to be on the couch, to play Netflix and chill, to, you know, have your tea and to stay there timid and be afraid of the world. It feels nice to stay in the comfort zone, but you better get the fuck out of there because that's not where you belong, okay? The comfort zone is not where you belong. You belong on the stage, so where you at, okay? You belong on the stage. You're an entertainer, whoever this message is for. You're going to get huge accolades and recognition. You're going to get one of these golden globe thingies. Okay? Like, chill. Yeah, I keep hearing that. Unexpected is on the bottom of the deck. I'm telling you, it's unexpected. You won't know when it's coming, okay? And then we have um, networking. So, yeah, look, everybody on social media, look at everybody on their computer, look, Googling you. Everybody's like, well, did you hear? Did you hear? Everybody's searching you up. You're networking online. You're going to blow up. Unexpectedly. Everybody's going to grab their computer, their phones, whatever. They're going to they're gonna see your shit. So you use your resources. Make sure you use your resources right now. Promote your stuff. Market your, your, your music, okay? Promote your music and stop trying to be such a perfectionist. The time is now, okay? I feel like I specifically am also talking about myself when I read these messages, but hey. <laughs> Anything else, Spirit? Okay, last card. We have designer. Yeah. See, some of you guys are multi-talented. You design your own clothes. I'm seeing like you're about to get the best designers, okay? The best designers are going to hit you up for the Oscars, for the VMAs, for whatever rewards people have for celebrities. I see you like the, the biggest designers hitting you up, making you the best dress or the best suit. Because you see this girl's wearing a beautiful dress here too. It's like you're going to have this big performance where you're going to get rewarded in the future. And you're going to wear this fucking beautiful dress. And you're going to be iconic, okay? This is an icon. Be careful where you spend your money, okay? Or where you blow up your money. Yeah, you, you could have been working a 9 to 5, an office here. Look at you signing the check. Look at you signing the contract. You're signing something. I see you signing a contract, okay? It says caution, though. Use caution when making financial decisions. Be careful what you sign. Read what you sign. Make sure you understand everything very specifically because once you sign that, that's it. You signed it, okay? Caution. It says here caution. Caution. Fear. Okay? Do not let this fear hold you back, though. Even though you know you've been unstable, you have something that's very crafty about you. Amy Herrera, thank you so much for your donation, Amy. Many blessings to you, love. Yeah, look, independent artist. You're an independent artist here, okay? Lastly, I'm going to give you some of these. Yeah, this is your life purpose. I'm going to use one of these oracle cards, guys, and then I'm going to let you go. But listen, this is a beautiful reading. This is a powerful reading. The universe notices you. The universe knows who you are. The universe fucking loves you. The universe recognizes you. And the world is going to fucking recognize you. They're going to need till they have no choice. This is God's plan. There's going to be jealousy. Okay? I'm getting... What is that called? I'm getting like that Miss Universe energy. You could be like a model or people say that you look like a model or something like that. Okay? Okay? Empress energy, baby. Empress energy. Not in better. Okay. Emperor energy. What up? <laughs> I just heard Joe Budden. Some of you guys may listen to Joe Budden. 38 Spech. Pop Poose. All right. RJ Payne. Okay. You may, yeah, you protect it. There's no need. Your future, your career, your whole life, your gift. What you're about to give birth to is highly protected. You see this? You're giving birth to this idea, this project, this gift. It's protected. Forgive yourself for anything in the past, okay? Just kind of go with the flow. Okay, we got Benny the Butcher. I don't know if you guys know Benny the Butcher. Uh, Conway, Griselda Records. Okay, I'm just channeling these rappers right now. But you don't have to be a rapper, okay? Good luck. I told you, that says twice here. You could be Irish. Listen, you're about to get that luck of the Irish, all right? Just you about to get that pot of gold. Your good luck is on your side. Not only is good luck on your side, but you also protect it. 
So this is it. This is like divinely guided. You only literally need to follow and lose control. Just allow. That's all you need to do. Because <coughs> everything else has been done for you by the universe. How dope is that? <coughs> exactly. <coughs> Happiness. <coughs> Happiness. You're about to be happy. That's it. Just, just accept it. Be happy. Fertility. Exactly. You're very fertile with ideas. Some of you guys may actually be pregnant. Um... You know? Yeah, look, talent. You talented. Come on, guys. You can't make this up. You talented. It's your talent that's being seen, that's being recognized. And your healing abilities, too. Beauty is here twice, guys. Something about your beauty. You're about to bring a lot of beauty to the world. You're manifesting this. And you're about to empower women, empower men, empower those people that, you know, have a harsh story just like you and have a dream just like you. But maybe they don't have the confidence, the money, the support. You're going to empower, empower people with your wisdom, your story, who you are, how it happened, how it went through, how you blew up. You're going to empower a lot of people. OK, so that's beautiful. Um, but you're beautiful. Whoever you are, you attractive, you handsome as fuck. I don't know who you are, but your beauty stands out here. It's your inner and outer beauty. Like, it stands out, like, a lot. I'm talking about a lot. All right? And we all we all know that Beyonce, okay, Alicia Keys, they sexy. They're beautiful, okay? So, and I'm not, you're, if you're a male watching, these are just the examples I'm using. I don't really, you know, know much handsome guy thingies to reference to, but take what resonates, okay? And leave what doesn't. Oh, Okay. Zuna Baptiste, thank you so much for your donation, my love. Thank you, Leah, for your donation. Wilkins, thank you for your donation as well. Um, Lyric Music, thank you for your for your donation. All right, many blessings to you guys. Okay, I got your names written down. Last card spirit, what's the last message? What's the last message? What's the last message for this artist here? What else do they need to know? Last message. Last message. Mm -hmm. Animals. Okay. So some of you guys may be very connected to animals, pets here. Okay. And thank you, Cora Holmes, for your donation. Many blessings to you, my loves. And then we have freedom. Okay. Okay. So you're breaking, you're breaking people free, but you're breaking yourself free. You're breaking free from something here. You're finally going to obtain that freedom that you want. You're going to get to travel anywhere, go anywhere, be whoever the hell you want to be. You're finally breaking free from a generational curse, from old conditionings, from insecurities, from whatever cage you metaphorically trapped yourself in. Someone here might actually, like I said, you've got out of jail. You feel free now. Okay. Nina, thank you so much for your donation, my love. And Sham and Serena, thank you so much for your donation. You know what else I just I just got? Spirit is saying, like, your music is very liberating. And with animals and freedom, okay, I feel like you could be some type of environmentalist who also in the future is going to free a lot of animals. Um, but also, I feel like you, you, you help free people that feel like they're an animal here. Like, you know, like, I feel like you're teaching people freedom, like, you shouldn't be treated like an animal. You know, we're humans or, um, you know, like you, you, you reminding people to wake up. You're reminding people to free themselves from humanity, society, mm -hmm. and they, and wake up right from this matrix. So it's like, I'm hearing like an animal in a cage. You could have felt like an animal in a cage, but you're breaking free. And as you do this, other people will break free from their chains as well. Okay. Grieving. Yeah. All right. So yeah. Willpower. All right. So this is what I have for you. Um, Spirit, are you guiding me anywhere else? Okay, I don't know. Spirit wants me to pull one more from here. And then I'm out of here, guys, honestly. I just came here for this. I'm going to start uploading um, Zodiac signs very soon. I know, guys, I have not been very good with the Zodiac signs this week. It's been December. It's almost the middle of December, and I haven't done one. But stay tuned because I am going to be uploading all Zodiac signs for December 2021 before we go into 2022.
which is your year, okay? Our year. It's going to be our year. All light workers, all amazing people, anyone who deserves their recognition, your voice is going to be heard. Your voice matters. Your voice is going to be recognized and your voice is going to be highly rewarded. Like you literally can make so much money. You're about to realize how much money you can make because of how, that powerful voice, that powerful talent that you have. All right, spirit, give me that one card. To end this message, what is that one card that you want me to pull? What is that one card? You have a beautiful voice is what I keep seeing. It's like a beautiful voice or, or talent. Divine sensuality. Exactly. It's like you're sexy. You're magnetic. People like you. Wow. We have the siren here. Exactly. Guys, look, I already did a reading about a siren. So if that message resonated with you, go check it out if, if you haven't. Okay. I already did a reading with this cover, this picture as the cover where I said you are a siren. If that resonated with you, go watch that. Okay. Because look, it's coming back up again. So you could have already watched this video. And this is like another part two or three to this. We have the call summoning the voice to acknowledge you are a siren your voice is beautiful you draw people in with your voice with your beauty right because a siren also has beauty sensuality but also a majestic voice and talent and you're answering the call that your spirit has been telling you go okay and you're going to be acknowledged sanctuary okay privacy personal space respected boundaries and taboos so right now this is the time for you to take your spiritual baths okay um, you need your personal space. Okay. So remember to set boundaries, keep some things private. Okay. Reflections, what you contemplate can actualize. Exactly. You've contemplated. It says what you contemplate will actualize. So make sure your thoughts are positive. This is something you have been, yeah, endurance. You've endured so much. You kept going. Because you kept going, you're being rewarded. Exactly. Reflections. Okay. It's like you self-reflected. You work on yourself. You manifested it through visualizing, through all this stuff. You're powerful. And you now you're believing that things can actually actualize, you know, through the power of manifestation, which, yes, it is true, you know. So, yeah, congratulations to whoever this message is for. Remember, you're about to have a lot of abundance, opportunity, recognition, Okay, um, I'm going to hear about you because the whole world is whoever you are. Okay. Um, but yeah. Like I said, there's going to be envy around you, but that's just that just comes with this, right? That comes with this. And don't deny this power. Don't deny this gift. Don't deny yourself this beautiful opportunity. Thank you, guys. Thank you for remembering me. <laughs> I'm like, hey, don't forget me. Ayo, thank you for your donation, Ayo. Where's the rest of my tarot? All right. All right, hold on. Spirit wants me to pull one more from here. <clears throat> Let's see what's your life purpose here real quick. Spirit, what is this person's life purpose? Obviously, you're an entertainer. You're in the music industry. But let's see if there's anything else that wants to come up. Don't forget to like this video, guys, if the message resonates. Thank you so much for your donations, your likes, your presence. Okay, we have Oracle cards. So like I said... You could read tarot here. Somebody here reads tarot, okay? Whoever this message is for, you're able to discern answers, okay? You read tarot, and this is part of your life purpose too. What else, spirit? I'm highly resonating with this message, just saying. Because <laughs> I'm definitely a tarot reader, and I'm giving out this message. And my birthday is right here on the likes. So, my birthday is January 18, guys. Let me tell you right now. My birthday is January 18. Okay, so I am going to want to be spoiled for my birthday. 
Do not forget me. I put my P.O. Box information down below. Spoil me on my birthday, guys. Okay? We have sensitivity. So you're an empath. You're a light worker. Some of you guys like to work with crystals, with tarot. You're earth angel. Okay? Earth angel. Options. Exactly. Your career, there's a lot of options. Okay? So... Your, your, the possibilities are endless with all that your life purpose entails. You could be a Libra here, but you're meant to bring justice to the to this humanity. Talk to your angels. Yeah, some of you guys here could talk to your angels. Oof, infinite abundance is your purpose. Infinite abundance is your purpose. Like I said, you're a leader. You're meant to lead. You're meant you're meant to lead, and you're gonna get a lot of money for this. Okay, you're gonna get a lot of infinite abundance from this. Like I said, you're gonna be highly supported when you step into this power. I feel like you are already. Yeah, time to decide. You're gonna need to make a decision here. Go towards what you desire or something. You need to make a decision and you need to trust. Thank you, Tyrone Bates Libra, for your donation. Many blessings. Family, okay. You're going to find your soul family. Spirit, tell me more about this artist. One more. Okay, we have these that came out. I'll take them. Author. Okay, so you're a writer. You're also writing a book. I'm also getting like your life story. Somebody may write a... a, a, a if you're not a writer, um, like just like a lyricist, composer, somebody's going to write a book about you. I also feel like somebody here is working about... Uh, it's writing a book that an angel is guiding you about. It's either about your story or the story about your family or how you grew up. We have support. So you're just going to be very supported. Okay, just do it. You're going to be highly supported. Like people, fans, spirit, everybody supports you. We have flowers. So with flowers, I'm getting like a lot of rewards. People buying you flowers. You may receive a lot of gifts from different artists or people like that, like with notes. And we have spiritual teacher as the last card. Exactly. You're a spiritual teacher. You're a guru, which I already said that. Okay, and yeah, you were meant to work with children too. It's like your music is going to inspire the next generation. Music, children, and career change. Some of you guys are going from teachers to teaching children to, to music, okay, to the music industry. You're changing your career. You need to focus on music. That's where your, your heart lies in, okay? Um, but yeah, some of you guys here, it's like you could have been a music teacher also, a flute clarinet teacher, piano teacher. You're leading the next generation here. You're leading the next generation. Beautiful, beautiful energy. Thank you so much, Dejan Dejanay. I haven't heard that name since the Proud family. Thank you, Dejanay, for your donation. The Proud family. Something about that show. Maybe you watched that show. Your family's going to be proud, though, okay? You're going to keep a lot of people proud. All right, guys. So this is the end of your reading. Let's close out this reading. Um, Ancestor Spirit Guides of the Highest White Light. I close out this reading, and I send all the energies back to the light where it came from. Thank you so much. We ended here. Ashe. Right, Ashe, guys. Okay, thank you for joining this live. Thank you for your donations. Thank you for your likes. Thank you for your support. And congratulations. Okay, congratulations more importantly than anything. You deserve this. You know you deserve this. Let's stop playing. Thank you, Angela Toms. Thank you for your donation, love. I channeled your grandmother. Nice. Beautiful. Yeah, your ancestors are looking up. They're looking out to you. Oh. <laughs> hey. All right. Later, guys.